Hey everyone, I'm Jason. Today's video is actually a video request on the Paradox. This is the IP180. So some of you have been sending me quite a bit of emails and a lot of questions on the IP180. So you guys are familiar with the IP150, which only has an ethernet. So the difference between these two is this one is Wi-Fi. Let's open this up. It comes with your standard wire. So it comes with an antenna. And the only difference is, so this is the IP180 right here. It's got the little slot for the antenna. And it still has the ethernet if you want to use the ethernet. So it's basically all in one. Okay, so today's video, I'm going to show you how to set this up. But before you guys go out and purchase one of these, just so you know, you cannot set this up if you're not a Paradox dealer. And the only other thing is this only works on their new app, which is the Blue Eye. So this is really easy to set up. If you guys still want to try it out and say you do have a dealer account, I'll show you how to set this up. Okay, so I got a panel in front of me. So here's the antenna part. So right over here, just push it in. Listen for that click. I don't know if you guys heard that. This section, there's a hole right here or here, whichever way you guys want. This still slides in this way. So I'm gonna put it on this side. Just gonna grab the little nut and washer lock that in place now we take the antenna same thing with the wire okay put the wire on the side now this goes on the serial port So we got the light flashing. So we're pretty much all done here. So this does have a personal hotspot, which we have to connect to. So if you got your cell phone, just look for the IP180, it's on there. I'm gonna use a computer. So let's go to the computer for the next part. Okay, so we're over here at the computer now. So what we gotta do is open up any web browser. But first thing we gotta do is open up your Wi-Fi. Here it is, mine is right here. It even says on it, IP 180, we need to connect to this. So press connect, close that. Okay, now we're gonna to go to the search bar on the top. Okay, so what you're gonna type in is 192.168.180.1. Enter, and now right here, connect IP 180 to a Wi-Fi network. So now here, you search for your Wi-Fi and you can even add one here if yours is hidden. So all you gotta do is click on the Wi-Fi, enter your password, and connect. And now automatically it's gonna kick you out. Keep in mind, every time you guys change your Wi-Fi or make any changes to your Wi-Fi, you're gonna have to readjust this. Okay, so once it's connected, we got the lights flashing now, and that's all you have to do on the computer. Once we do this part, same thing with your phone. The only difference is if you're gonna use your phone to set this up, you do need to change the DNS on your phone. Okay, so let's do the setup on the phone now. So we're gonna go to Wi-Fi on your phone. You're gonna look for the IP180. Mine's right here. So now we're gonna to connect to it. Now we're gonna hit that little exclamation mark. We need to get into the settings. So, so we're gonna click on it, and now we go all the way to the bottom here. We're gonna change this to automatic, to manual, and now we're gonna type in an IP address. So I'm typing in 192.168.180.10. And the subnet, we're gonna type in 255.255.255.0. Now we're gonna hit save. So this way now we're on the same network as the IP180. Okay, so we're gonna close this. Now we're gonna open up a browser and we're gonna type in the browser in the top corner, same like the PC. We're gonna type in 192.168.180.1, enter. And here's your Wi-Fi list. 
So now it's the exact same steps as the PC. Okay, so once you connect to it, if you do it correctly, you're gonna get the Wi-Fi and the Swan light lit up on the IP180 module. Okay, so now let's go set this up on the app. So let's head over to the App Store. And once again, the app is called Paradox Blue Eye. And this is the one we want. I already have it installed, so I'm gonna open. I just wanna remind you guys one more time, you can only set up this app if you are a Paradox dealer or a Paradox installer. You need an installer account in order to program this system. Okay, that being said, we're gonna go all the way to the top. We're gonna hit the three dashes. I'm already logged in. I'm gonna to go to installer menu. Now the three dots in the top corner, we're gonna tap on it. We're gonna hit create new site. The IP180 does not have the QR, so we're gonna hit insert panel serial number manually. And you can find this right here on the alarm panel. So we're gonna type it in. Now you're gonna enter a site name and a master email. And this is all to it. So once you enter this information in, it's gonna detect your IP180. It's gonna display right here at the bottom. The other thing is, once you set this up, they only give you now seven day free trial. It used to be 30 days. Now they cut that down to seven days. After the seven day trial, you could subscribe for one year or three years. So let's say you changed your Wi-Fi or something else has changed on your network and you lost connection to it, you will have to do a factory reset. So in order to do a factory reset, it's actually pretty simple. All you have to do is, to factory reset this, all you need is a paper clip or something small enough to fit inside this hole. So what you're gonna do is, we're gonna press and hold. When the light starts to blink, we're gonna release and press it again within about a second. Okay, so let's do this now. So press, hear that click, we're gonna press and hold. So you see the light, let go, press it one more time and release. Now everything turns off. And there you go. So now we lost the Wi-Fi and the SWAN. Now this system is factory reset. So now you could reactivate it with a new Wi-Fi. That's all I have for you guys today. If you guys have any other questions, please give me a comment below. If you like this video, hit those thumbs up. If you want to see more like it, make sure you hit that subscribe button. And like always, thanks for watching and have a great day.